Okay, so Will Seth, mm -hmm. what do you love about your life? I love about my life that um, I've found my way in the world somehow, that I've been able to do just what I want, that um, when I was younger I didn't understand how I was supposed to fit into the world, mm. and I didn't realize that I was figuring it out slowly over time, but I was. I was figuring it out. And now I, I'm just grateful that I, um, I get to do the things that I love and, and, and mm. I, I have a little bit of freedom to do them the way that I think they should be done. Yeah. And that I've been able to make a enough of a living from mm. it to keep doing it. That's yeah. what I'm most grateful for. Um, mm. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm most grateful for. Okay, and 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 what does community mean to you? I think that community um well when I hear that word, uh I immediately think community these days seems like it's hard to come by. Mm -hmm. Um I think that when the world was smaller and um, it was harder to get from one place to another and mm -hmm. it was harder to, we didn't have the internet or, or things like that and we didn't have as many distractions, I think community was something you couldn't escape, mm -hmm. you know, sometimes in a good way and maybe sometimes in a bad way. Mm -hmm. um, because sometimes community can be suffocating if you live in a small town and, and everybody knows your business, you know. But at, at other times, and I'd say most of the time, mm -hmm. community is this beautiful thing that, that holds us all together and catches people when they fall and lifts yeah. people up. And, and it's, it's like this active human web that's like, it's, it's, I think it's such a significant part about being a human being. And I, and I think that in our sort of more modern world, community doesn't, it's harder to find mm. and it's harder to sustain. I think it's important to our souls to have community uh, and to exist within a community. And I mm. think that if people don't feel like they're part of a community, mm. they can, it's bad for their mental health. Um, so I think community is one of the most important things that human beings need to survive, I guess. Yeah. And and so where does um um where does creativity can come into to such be beautiful music? Where does it come in? Mm. Um I don't, I don't, sometimes I feel like I don't understand oh. what creativity is. Um, mm. it, it feels like it's such, been such a part of my life. Um, the dedicating myself to creativity mm -hmm. has been the most significant thing in my life. But then when I try to understand what creativity is, yeah. I, I don't always understand because okay. I, I feel like it doesn't, I don't know what, it's such a hard question. I know. Because I think that, um, I think the fact that everybody dreams, everybody lies down and all night long they dream. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the most, um, the most conservative small-minded, logical person was still goes to sleep and has crazy fantasy dreams yeah. in their heads. I think that there's something about people that imagination is this gift that, and a mercy and that there's something really vitally important about it. Um, and that's what I'm trafficking in. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, but I also don't 
know if I fully understand what it's for. Okay. I feel like it's really, really important, and I feel like it's a really big part of the puzzle, but I feel like I don't have the answers to why. <laughs> that's, wow. just the, that's just my honest response. But that's really cool. Thank you yeah. so much. Yeah. Thank you so much, Bjorn. Yeah. I appreciate it, man. Sure. Cool. <laughs> All right. Great. Yeah.